Hey everyone, how's it going? I hope that everybody has been doing well, especially after we had had that week off on our live streams. We are back with some more reactions with the next Shaman King, here to do episode 8, Progress, and I think it's going to be a great time. As you all know, we had watched the original Shaman King anime and read the manga a while back, but it's been a long time, for a little about 20 years since the anime, and uh, you know we forget some things. Things change, and we get new adaptions, such as the 2021 version, which has honestly been pretty decent. I thought it was a little fast in some places. It is moving pretty quickly. I wish some of the episodes were a little bit slower, and that they had opted for maybe a 16 episode season instead of a 13 episode season which is what i believe they went with but either way i think it's been pretty great last episode we had the battle with faust and i love that battle uh faust is one of my favorite um semi-mythical characters and you know there is such a mythos behind it that you can apply to anything that it was done so well in this one plus it really exemplifies the greatness of shaman king and that multicultural uh multi faceted and kind of re even religious approach in a lot of the ways because shaman king is kind of religious in some of its aspects of the great spirit you have the native american tribes we don't want to you know spend all day harping on it what i do want to do is you know give a big special shout out to everybody watching on youtube and even special a shout out to our people watching on patreon who you know for as low as a dollar a month get access to the uncut full video full audio all great stuff that we can't show on youtube and of course to everybody who uh wants to do that you can check that out in the link below but if not i still appreciate you for watching on youtube i appreciate you for you know checking us out wherever you do and as always you can come chat with us either in the comments below on our social media or on discord you know any of those places no matter what you do remember support the original content creator because without them we don't get amazing products like this period and, uh, you know, we want more of that. So we're going to have to give them more great stuff, right? With that said, we're going to go ahead and hop right into episode eight. I believe this is going to be kind of a mid episode. I don't believe we're going to get the fight between Yo and uh, Ren. But I might be wrong. It's been a while. And they do like to go pretty fast on this. So maybe they'll kind of just skip over that altogether. This is his little sister's actual I forgot about these guys. Oh, yeah! I forgot about his weird-looking dad. He's also super short. He's in the hospital. And then I remember this. He's like trying to avoid Manta because he got hurt and he wants to not get him hurt anymore. I already know otherwise this would be a bit of a dick move. Though not entirely incorrect, but just dick move. Nope. Which is funny how Ren advanced so far, but I think he had like this really grueling hellish training because he lost and got in trouble with his family. I remember how he does this. I can't remember if it's here or later where he goes to the cave. My wallet's in my suitcase! Huh? Oh shit, look at his little- he got the hair thing! But yes! Look at his little mini pop and they're going up! <laughs> it's so funny! And it's, it's slowly getting to shape more like a heart. They need to get it to the heart shape, man. See, his voice fits really well. But I'm a friend with the players. Ah, oh, I love Ryu. Ryu's dope. He's like, he starts as a bit of a heel. But oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he looks, they're drawing him so sexy. I don't know why, like, with weird big lips, like, really big lips, and, and he's trying to get shaman training. <laughs> as long as it makes me look cool. Cool gets the girls. Like, he has, they drew him with really big lips. I don't know, maybe I'm just tripping. But I, I envy your simplicity. Uh, these two are a great pair, but I love, I love Ryu. Ryu is, Ryu is one of my favorite characters in this series, but maybe just in general. Oh, this chick! 
how did this ever end up? I forgot about this. Holy shit. And her weird ass pets. <laughs> I love this chicken. It made her look so cool. Could bring disaster, yeah. Right, that's what they that's what I thought. She's not a great div div diviner. You are. Oh my god. Oh they did it! Oh! Oh! It's so bad! Oh! They did it! Those are his nuts! Those are his balls, bro! No, don't show him, don't show him, don't show him, don't show him, don't. It's uh, Tamamura Tamao. Oh, not Ponchi. No, and that's not his whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna talk about it in Konchi. I can't believe they showed it. I don't think they did in the old one because it was way too, you know, not right. Oh, look at it, it's got the vibe. That's what it was. Oh, she fucks him up. She has like. Oh, not again. Now he has two little ones. Oh, yeah, right in the dick. And they, they took another layer, so now he has a little one growing in a little one and another one. Not with the nuts, why? Oh, and they animated it so, like, good but bad. Oh, and he just pissed on him. Oh, that's a little much even for me. An acolyte. I actually think the bow is prettier, but... Yeah, here she goes with her dumbass arrow thing. The music, though. And she can use Oversoul, which means she was probably stronger than Yo. Granted, she stayed there and trained. <laughs> the music's so interesting. <laughs> brutal. I definitely think Kamala is cuter than Anna, but I like different things. Yeah, that would most likely kill you. Tomodachi. Oh. The, it, they didn't do a lot on the inside, and I wonder if they will later. The stuff in the manga on the inside of the cave is actually some dope shit. I think. Or maybe they didn't show anything. It's been so long. I, I gotta go read it again. Why are you so relaxed? Look how cute she is. I think he looks so cool with his hair up like that. I don't remember where his dad's at. See, they're both rich because they are mediums. And, you know, uh oh. Let's see the results. This is gonna be dope. It, it actually is dope. It's so cool the way they visualize this. Yes, I love his grandpa. His grandpa is a real one. This is also, like you said, a signature spell. This is a low level thing. All cut. Every leaf. <laughs> that see, see, his whole arm is done up now instead of just the hand. It's so good. It's so cool, man, the way he visualizes it. Oh, and his crazy ass tattoo that shows through his outfit. Milk. Shaman horse. Fucking horse shaman. Come on, is that not cheating? 
タオケの復讐と最高を遂げたところで。I do remember that. I remember he does not like his dad, and then when he loses this, if he loses this, I fucked that up. See how his tattoo shows through the hole in the back? I fucked that up. I shouldn't reveal that. But when he loses this, his dad gets pissed, and there's this hole saving him from saving him from the family. I'm a shaman king. And destroy all the fetters. He's crazy. I love him though. And that's the episode, guys. I thought that was great. I, I really do. Uh, I, I don't know. I think that there's a lot to be said for the way that they do these things now. But most of all, I think that the animation makes it great. The overall quality increase does impact it. And because the change in pace and like. Orientation of some of the scenes isn't huge. I think it does a good job. Plus, I'm I'm getting so many flashback and kind of like um, what what's the what's the word I'm feeling um, not reminiscent but nostalgic, right? From my old times of having watched this, and I'm nostalgic for all these crazy things that have been going. But yeah, I think it's been really good. I'm enjoying it, and I'm hoping that we're gonna have. Some more great episodes coming up. Obviously, next episode is going to be the Ren and Yo fight. But I thought there was so much good in this episode. Oh my god, there was so much, like not bad in the sense of like bad in the anime, but like, oh man, they animated those nuts, so real, those bulls. Ugh. Uh, and I don't really usually have a problem, but the way they animate those ones is just like rough. The Ponchi's ones have always been disturbing to me, and I don't know why. I feel like they're just old man. Sack, but yeah, enough about that. As always, thank you for watching. Super big shout out to the patrons who get to watch this, you know, a couple days early with full video, full audio, and no cuts like I have to do for YouTube. For everyone on YouTube, I appreciate you as well, and I hope you enjoy watching. We will still always put up most of our episodes for free on YouTube a little later, where you can like, comment, talk with us on there, subscribe to see more stuff, or hit the bell for notifications on all our releases, which are usually about three times a week so far. Uh, we are still working on getting all of our channels and updates and everything consistent, but I think we're starting to make better progress, and after our week off, we're feeling rejuvenated to do more of these reactions. I do have to create some intros, and we are starting a new series uh, that I've never read before or heard of before, but looks really interesting and just started on Crunchyroll, so hopefully look forward to that. With all that said, we don't want to take too long, so remember to support the original content creator, and if you enjoyed watching, check us out next time here on Reactions with the next Shaman King.